हरे कृष्णा सपोज वी वॉन्ट टू ड्राइव ओवर अ लॉन्ग जर्नी टू सम इम्पॉर्टेंट डेस्टिनेशन नो समाइम्स वेन वी आर ड्राइविंग इफ द ट्रैफिक इज क्लियर वी कैन गो फास्ट बट इफ द रोड इज वेरी क्राउडेड ट्रैफिक इज हैवी देन वी मे हैव टू गो स्लोली इफ वी गेट टू डिसहार्टेंड बिकॉज द ट्रैफिक इज सो हैवी and we decide oh i am not moving forward then i'll not go i'll not drive itself then we will never get to the destination similarly in our lives whenever we want to achieve anything long term and the ultimate long term goal is to achieve love for krishna for such a long term goal if we need to persevere and in the journey of life we can we need this approach of being fixed in purpose and flexible in pace to drive towards krishna fixed in purpose means that whatever happens we need to persevere we need to make that krishna is the ultimate purpose of my life and no matter what happens i am going to stay fixed in that however at different times in our life different things may become important either because of our outer conditions or even because of our inner conditionings and although krishna is the most important uh, priority purpose in our life most important thing in our life sometimes other things may temporarily become more urgent sometimes the road of our life may become crowded with traffic sometimes we may uh, our health may collapse and we may need to attend to our health sometimes there may be a heavy Uh, work pressure some project deadlines at work and we need to give more attention over there sometimes uh, sometimes in a family there might be some crisis and we need to give attention to that now uh, when such things happen we may think oh i am getting no time for practicing my krishna bhakti whole properly and i will never be able to do it the, the standards of krishna bhakti are way too high to be realistic and we think like this we may just give up the practice but we need to recognize that we don't have to give up this just at such times we may have to go a little slowly uh, and the wonderful thing is when we are practicing krishna bhakti even if we are doing our worldly responsibilities in a mood of service towards krishna we are also going towards krishna through that so of course our direct devotional activities may temporarily become a little less but we don't have to become disheartened we can keep moving forwards even if slowly and when the if we are fixed in purpose then as soon as the traffic becomes clear then we will start moving faster and we'll move towards krishna the test of our sincerity is not that we are becoming slow but whether we stay slow even after the traffic clears so krishna accommodates uh, us according to our conditions and conditionings uh, within his inclusive plan of grace by telling us that uh, we can connect with him at various levels and in 12.8 to 12 krishna gives us multiple levels to connect with him he says first fix your mind and intelligence in me mayeva mana datsva mai buddhim neveshaya ivasishyasi mayeva ata urdham na samshaya so just become absorbed in me and you will not only attain me but you will live in me right now but if somebody can't do that if their mind is not naturally absorbed in krishna then he says ata chittam samadha tum na shaknosi mai sthiram abhyas yoge na tato mam ichhap tum dhananjaya do diligent practice of bhakti yoga and by that you get the desire to attain me and like that he goes on 12.10 and he says if you can't even practice sadhana bhakti then just work for me abhyas epya samarthosi mat karma paramo bhava madartham api karmani kurvan siddhim avapsisi then just work for me and by such work you will attain me athaitte athaitat apya saktosi kartum mad yogam ashitah sarva karma phala tyagam tatah kuru yatatmavan if you can't do that then just you can't even work for me then just cultivate self selflessness by giving up the fruits of your work for some good cause so krishna in this four verses is allowing us leave a space within which we can adjust our pace so krishna is saying through all these we will progress towards him 
So each of these levels we could say is moving to Krishna at a in the same direction, the same purpose, but at a lower pace. And at different stages in our life, we may find different pace, paces the best to pursue our purpose. So by recognizing that Krishna consciousness can include flexibility in pace, uh, pace, we can cultivate fixity in purpose and march towards Krishna through whatever life sends our way. Thank you. Hare Krishna.